Donald and Nellie's unconditional love. Hello, my beautiful divine soul, beings of light, extensions of divine source energy. That's you, nothing other than that. Your beautiful, beautiful power, you're a creator. Be an extension of that divine source energy. Call it what you like, beautiful divine soul. Call it God, the universe, Krishna, Allah, Buddha, uh, Jehovah. Whatever you like, it's, it's all right in you, in your reality. Um, I have a little bit of water in the right now because we're just coming from the pool, beautiful the device. So we've been there for like a couple of hours with Nelly. And um, the music is a little bit loud, but you can still hear me. And right now we're here at Sky Zone, as you can see, one of Nelly's favorite plays. Uh, and this is why I got inclined to do this video. Um, the message of the video today is about the ego. And uh, and it's about how letting your ego go. As always, I'm gonna use myself as an example. Today, um, I'm a huge, for all of you who don't know or who know me personally or know me from the videos that, I, that I've done, you know that I'm, I used to play soccer on a competitive level back on my, on my day. So I'm a huge soccer fan. I love, I love soccer. I love watching soccer. And there's beautiful over there. And I love soccer. And um, today, uh, like I said, like I said on my video, Times and Illusion, whenever you watch these videos, you probably benefit from the information that I'm giving you. But, um, if you want to do your uh, your your, uh, your research today, it's um, it's March 19, and today it was El Clásico, El Clásico game for all, for all of you who know about a little bit about soccer. El Clásico in Spain is between Real Madrid and Barcelona, and I'm a huge fan of Barcelona. So it was that game was was uh, was uh, played today. And I had the opportunity to go, but that was my ego telling me that I wanted to go to, to see the game. I wanted to be the game, uh, at the game and watch it and enjoy it. But also Nelly, when I was with Nelly, Nelly said, oh, I want to go to the pool and I want to go to Skyson and jump. So the ego a little bit said, oh, I want to watch the game, but then he wants to do it. So the beauty about letting the ego go is you still have the ego beautiful device so you 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 always gonna need the ego as a tool but you need to know when to do use your ego and when not to do when not to use your ego you can use your ego as a as a defense mechanism as a tool for you to, to if you're in fear for something and and then you think you're fearful that you're gonna crash or you in your car or you're gonna fall from a cliff or something like that that's your ego telling you hey be careful so you can use that as a tool to, to be careful, but in other in in other cities, the ego will tell you, no, it's, I come first. You know my personal pleasure, my personal uh, you know you know if I want to eat this instead of giving it to somebody else, or if I want to do this instead of other people. That's your ego. The beauty about about letting the ego go and putting it on check, controlling the ego, controlling that beautiful that, that beautiful ego that is with you. What is your divinity? What is your ego? The divinity is letting that ego go and do something for everyone else. In this case, it's my beautiful lady of God, And you might be saying, oh, he's saying this in the video because he's doing it for his little girl. No, I've done this. I mean, in this video, yes, it's the message is because I've done it with Nelly, for, for Nelly. You know, I'm doing it for Nelly right now. But on plenty of occasions, I've done it for anybody else you can name it and I've done it I'm using myself as an example to don't uh, don't make judgments or or discernments on anybody else so I've done it so instead of doing what I needed to do I do it for somebody else because that's what I get my biggest reward my biggest reward is that I've done it with somebody else because what I sent out there is gonna bounce back to me so I don't doubt beautiful device so you that are watching this video right now 
if I will ever ever need something, you will not hesitate to give me a helping hand. Because what I send out there is what bounce back. And you can see this throughout the video. So the message is that even though I wanted to watch that game today, I said no. The game is still gonna be played, but I'd rather I'd rather be with Nelly and enjoy, raise my frequency, raise my vibration, and then there will be another opportunity to watch the game. Because these beautiful rainbow children will come and tell you the message right there and then to teach you, to teach you what's really important in life. And I've done it so many times that now that I'm in this, in this spiritually path, in this, in this spiritual way, I know when, when to do things and when not to do things. It's good to do things for yourself, but if there's other things that will benefit your vibration and raise your frequency and fill your heart with this unconditional love, choose that instead, beautiful divine soul. So this is what this video is all about. It's about me letting my ego go, me putting my ego in check, and me coming and being here, raising my frequency, my vibration from this beautiful little girl. And uh, I'm, I'm a little bit, um, you know, I'm a little bit in the, into really emotional right now because the best thing that that happened right now, Nelly goes and, and she goes and she says, well, I'm hungry right now, Daddy, let's go eat Chinese. And I go say, but Nelly, by the time we're done with the bounces, the Chinese might be closed because that's what she wanted to do. And then she said, well, let me have pizza instead. And I went and got her slice of pizza with her drink. And then as soon as, as soon as she's done eating, she tells me, Dad, get up. She says, Dad, get up. I, I get up. And then she reaches her hand and she goes, I love you, Daddy. And she told me, and she gives me a big kiss. And she said, I have the best guy in the world. Because that just gave my heart to the blind story. It was such a beautiful feeling that uh, it's priceless. And what I, just, what I just can tell you is that it's okay if you get emotional and, 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 and feeling like this, but out of happiness and out of joy, because that's the biggest reward. For all of you that are fathers, parents out there, and, 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 and have these beautiful little children out there, that you're providing and that you're caring for. Put them as a priority. Because what you put out there, how you teach them, how you raise them, is the way how they're gonna become, how they're gonna grow up, and they're gonna they're gonna be that kind of people. I mean, they're gonna be beautiful lives, but they're gonna become in this human experience that kind of people that you don't I'm not gonna hesitate to help others, but I'm not gonna hesitate to lend a helping hand throughout that unconditional love that they already have. So, be love, kindness, be love, awareness, benefit from this video. Send it and share it to somebody that's gonna benefit from this video. And, uh, just be the best version of yourself. Because you already are beautiful. You are you already are powerful. It's whether you have to make that decision and that choice and put that ego in check. Perfect example like this today. And I I think throughout my this almost five hundred videos that I've done, I never done one one like this where where the tears came out of my eyes like today. But it was Meant to be, it, it had to happen today. 
he had to have him play. And uh, there's not a coincidence in this universe for the Bible. Everything's meant to be at the precise time, at this present moment, at this now. So, all I can tell you is let the ego go. Whatever you think is going on in your life and it's more important than be of service to someone else. Or, or especially your own little children or your own family. Because at the end of the day, you are one, one is all. For everyone and everyone, so we're all connected. So whatever you will do for, for one, that, that person probably will do it for you. Go with that mentality. So... I'm gonna keep this video short, beautiful tonight, so because I'm gonna go ahead and enjoy Nelly. This is the message of today. Let the ego go. There will be another opportunity for you, for you to do what you wanted to do. And if you have a choice to make, if make somebody laugh and make somebody happy, let this video be a, a, an example. Because I wouldn't, I wouldn't change or trade this day not even watching the, the final on the World Cup because that beautiful that beautiful moment when my little girl said get up and she looked at me with those eyes glazing a little bit with tears and she told me she looked at me and said I love you I love you I have the best dad in the world I love you so much gets me like this. So I love you, beautiful goodbye phone. I send you my love. I tell you that I love you. That we move one so we want one so on itself. And that beautiful little beautiful baby. Bye-bye. And leave you with that saying from me and Hace el bien sin mirar a quien. Do good to everyone without prejudice. No human is being for me. I don't think maybe profound as this one because this is one of a kind. Don't you simply for the bicycle. Namaste.